This is a talk about spiral dynamics and the stages you go through in mastering your profession. Good morning, this is Wake Up with another talk about spiral dynamics. Spiral dynamics or levels of human existence as it has been called before can be used to describe the consciousness of a person or of a group of people. But it can be used also in an evolutionary sense. For example, the stages you go through in learning a profession, from the beginning to the point where you attain full mastery in that profession, which then of course does not turn out to be the end. In an evolutionary sense, the first color is beige, and beige is either that you dabble in that profession without any education in it, or that you do have an education, but you only do it to survive. It's not a profession that you have a real interest in, but you only do it to earn your bread or to secure your family's survival. The next color is purple, where you see that alone it doesn't really work. So either either you start something with other people together, like a startup nowadays, or you delve deeper into a certain profession by doing an apprenticeship or study at university or do some other course or learn from someone else who is better than you. The next color is red, and red means that you now attained a point where you think you're really, really good and you can do almost anything. This is the typical megalomania of, for example, students after they finish their master's degree and they enter professional life and they think they can change the world with a little bit of theory they learned in university. Or else you really are successful with your startup and now you really make a big company out of it. Maybe you even throw out the others with whom you have started the company and now it's all yours and you're up on the road of fame and wealth. The next color is blue, the color of order and discipline and religion. This is again a more social color. It's always alternatingly a more individual and a more social color. So blue, you start or join some kind of association. You need the exchange and the security of others of your stage of development. Or else you start another education, a further education, which has very, very strict rules and almost is like a religion. Then there's orange. The aim of orange is efficiency. Either you invent something or buy something that makes your work, your profession more efficient or more scientific or in some sort of way that you can earn more money than before. Some sort of expansion. Afterwards is green and in green you start doubting everything you have done and learned before. The whole thing starts to sound to you a little bit and feel to you a little bit selfish and pointless. There must be something more, something more than doing, exercising this profession, then earning money, having a house and a family and two cars, you getting interested in the environment and in spirituality and in more uncommon practices. You start to explore less well-known aspects of your profession or change your profession altogether. The next color is yellow. In yellow, you really, your aim is mastery. You think now you really want to learn everything that this profession is about. You're participating in a 101 courses and buy a thousand books and scour the internet. You ask famous people if you can learn from them. You probably start teaching if you have not started teaching already in blue or orange or green. And this is a stage where you can really get stuck in. You can get stuck in every stage. 
at this stage you can get stuck in because there's no end. There's an unlimited amount of things, number of things to learn. It never ends because what you really need is something inside of you. You need to tap a source that is inside of you, not outside of you. Once you realize that, turquoise is next. In turquoise, you tap into the intuition, intuitive knowledge. You can learn anything you want just by wanting to be able to do it. True knowledge just starts pouring in. You can just do it. You have an idea and then you can just do it. This is called manifestation in the New Age lingo. So the first cities are starting to manifest. Now you really can do things that almost no one else can do. You thought that several times before, but now it's true. And again, turquoise is a more social color, so you seek out other people who have the same skill and same experience. You need the exchange. And you also know now that any way be it a profession or anything else, is culminating in something deeper, and something, for lack of a proper word, spiritual. The whole road you have been traveling so far has been leading to this point, and you see that mastery in a profession is really a mastery of yourself, or something deeper. Self is not really the right word anymore. This is also a color to get stuck in because it feels very comfortable. It feels very comfortable to be in contact with this inner force, with this inner clarity and intuition. Here again, it is very probable that you start teaching, that you feel the need to pass your knowledge and experience on. And then coral hits you. Coral is like a bomb. The realization hits you that you have attained mastery now and that this is not what you wanted. It feels empty and meaningless. Everything you have attained so far and everything you ever wanted to attain feel meaningless. Because by attaining that mastery you have seen through some of the veils of reality and see that the whole reality is not what you thought it was. So you enter a period of deep reflection and probably introverted seclusion, finding out who the hell you really are and what reality is and what truth is, if there is a truth and what do you want to do from now on? Do you want to continue in that profession? Do you want to do something completely different? Do you want to do anything at all? You burn all bridges and you throw away everything and you want to start completely new. This time to really follow the flow, not to listen to any preconceptions, to any dispositions, to any thoughts and emotions. Just follow the flow. Which leads you to the next color, teal. In teal you transcend duality and is a color of completion and full immersion intuition. You may still continue with your profession, but maybe not, it doesn't matter your way will be shown to you. So that's it for today. Thank you for listening. Thank you for subscribing. Hit the bell button and see you very soon. Bye.